Hello, this is Chris Jones, Everyday VBA. In this video, we are going to do another Macro Monday. If you're not sure how Macro Monday works, they're pretty simple. I put out a challenge every Monday and give you a week to work on it. Then I post my solution on Fridays. I have them up through the weekend and then I take them down. So that's how Macro Monday works. Okay, today it is a very fun one. We are actually going to be doing the text to columns. Um, you probably use this in Excel if you haven't. It's actually pretty awesome. It's right here, text to columns, where you can delimit based on uh, commas. You can do it based on uh, spaces, whatever you want to do. Um, it's a really cool thing to do. Um, and there you can actually also do the same thing in Visual Basic, and it is a very useful function. Now, there's a couple ways to do it. I do show you two different ways to do it in the video. Uh, the first is kind of my recommend, recommended in the solution. The second is uh, is really kind of a more challenging more challenging one. But here we have it. So how this works is you're going to come in. We're going to run our macro. We're going to go to Developer tab. We're going to go to Macros. I've got a couple here. This is just text to columns. And how this works is you're going to put in a delimiter. Now you'll notice I've got my little text right here, uh, comma, text, delimited, text to columns. Um, for the active cell, that's kind of a hint there. For the active cell, you're going to put in whatever your delimiter is, and you're going to split that into the number of columns. So, for example, if we do it on this one, kind of a little, uh, sorry, I'm going to attach this to a button. I've gotten so, <laughs> so used to attaching this stuff to buttons, I'm like, I forget where the, where the macro, macro button is. Okay, so now let's just do this with a space. So we're going to put in a space. We're going to hit OK, and it's going to basically bust that out for us, which is awesome. Uh, how about pipes? Do pipes work? What is a pipe? Uh, it's the key, actually, if you hit Shift, it's the key over Enter. It looks like a long I, long capital I. Do pipes work? Oh, it does. So that is your Macro Monday challenge. It is to basically code up a text-to-columns solution. Um, you guys are going to love the, love my answers on Friday. You're going to love the solution. If you have, if you figure this out, please put, please put your code in the comments. It's very helpful. If you have questions or are stuck, put your comments. Make sure that you're liking the Everyday VBA channel, and I hope you guys enjoy.